Dengue infections are currently the most important mosquito borne viral infection in the world uh, as well in Sri Lanka. Uh, so we have been actually interested in uh, looking at what causes severe dengue for a very long time. Uh, fortunately, only a small proportion of patients who develop dengue uh, uh, get severe dengue. Uh, and the main cause of getting severe disease is because of leakage of fluid from the capillaries. So our main interest has been to look at what causes fluid leakage. Uh, so a lot, our whole team has been working on this and we've got a big team who work really hard day and night trying to solve all these problems. Uh, so uh, first we found that uh, platelet activating factor was the main cause of vascular leak. And fortunately there is already a drug that blocks uh, platelet activating factor uh, called rupetidine. Uh, so we did the first trial uh, using rupetidine in the infectious diseases hospital in 183 patients. It was a phase 2 trial and the data looked quite promising. Uh, so we have just uh, begun the next phase of our trial uh, which, we will be, uh, which we have started in the OPD setting uh, by giving the drug at an early stage because what we found that uh, when you give the drug early on in uh, disease it appeared to have uh, show benefits in reducing uh, uh, fluid leakage and dengue associated complications. As far as I believe, uh, uh, we do a lot of work at the Centre for Dengue Research and uh, the, ma the main reason that uh, we have been able to work uh, and, and uh, take our findings from the lab uh, into a translational level uh, into a clinical trial is because the hard work of everybody who, who works in our unit we have a lot of uh, research assistants, PhD students uh, and, and postdoctoral scientists uh, and other staff members working in our unit and uh, everybody has a lot of fun working and they are really uh, driven and they want to find the answers to all these questions. Uh, so I think uh, that is the main reason that uh, you know, like we have been able to do a lot of work and uh, all the students uh, actually are very interested and uh, so basically as far as the way I see research is uh, human beings are naturally curious beings and that's why we have been able to discover so many things and evolve and take the human race forward uh, and uh, there is nothing as far as research is actually satisfying your curiosity. You have uh, all these burning questions which you need to answer and, and uh, it's so much satisfying answer, finding answers to these uh, burning questions because it's like reading a very uh, exciting novel. Uh, so you, you can't, when you f get into a very interesting part in the novel, uh, you, can't, you can't stop, when you get to a very exciting part in the film, you don't want to stop watching, you want to keep going on and see what happens next. So uh, research is the same, so when you've got somewhere and you have got some really exciting findings, you want to know what happens next, you want to know what all this means. So all the people working uh, in our unit are driven uh, by curiosity to know what happens next. So, and, and that is uh, what, what actually makes us all happy and, and make us work and uh, hopefully find answers uh, to, to and solve problems uh, related to dengue.